Hey everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to manually install the latest driver for your graphics card. Now you need to know the manufacturer of your graphics card to be able to install the latest driver for it. So to find the manufacturer of your card in, in Windows 7 you want to go to start, right click on my computer and then go to manage. Then go to device manager and then click on display adapters and then here's your card right click on it and then go to properties here you've got your manufacturer in this case it's Nvidia and if you go to the drivers tab you can see your current driver version now that we know our manufacturer is Nvidia you want to go to their website to install the latest driver so open up web browser and go to Nvidia Once you are at the manufacturer's website, they'll ask you for some, some information about your card to find the driver for it. So first, they'll ask you the product type. The product type here is obviously GeForce. As you can see, my card is NVIDIA GeForce 210. So, so if yours might be different. So GeForce. And then they ask you for the product series. The product series is, if you look at the name here, it says GeForce 210. The first digit number, the 2, I have two which which will mean that my series is going to be 200 series so if I go to 200 se series here I should be able to find my card in the product here which is GeForce 210 now it'll ask you for your operating system the current operating system you're running if you don't know which operating system you're running you can simply go to start right click on your computer again and this time to go to properties here you can see your system type running I'm running 32 bit operating system Windows 7 so you select your operating system and then finally select the language that you want and then search for the drivers here you'll see some information about the driver and here the, the 266.58 the five digit number just compare it to your current driver version and see if you need to install if, if your driver is up to date or not for example here mine's clearly up to date because the numbers are the same but if yours isn't just simply download it click download and it'll download if you've got any problems with your new installed driver you can always roll back here you'll have an option to roll back driver and it'll just go to a previous driver but you shouldn't have any problems because uh, all new drivers are more advanced and better than previous ones thanks for watching